Hello ladies and gentlemen, it's Mike here at Game From Scratch and we have a new tool from Kenny of Kenny and L fame. Now if you've never heard of Kenny before, you have no doubt seen some of his assets. He makes a ton of uh, pre-made assets for games 2D and 3D. They're used in all kinds of documentation and tutorials. You have no doubt encountered them somewhere if you have read any tutorials on any site. Uh, pretty much everybody has used them at some point, including myself. But what we're today talking about is one of his tools. He's made an increasing number of these mixer tools, creature mixer, ship mixer, and the one we are talking about today is avatar mixer. Basically, they take uh, boiler point um, sprite images and kind of compose them together. So what you've got, it's kind of like working in a video game. You've got a number of different pieces to start with. So here you've got your backgrounds, for example, uh, three different textures to start with. Over time, he adds more components to work with, by the way. Uh, your basic head profile shape. So we got this style right now. We can give this guy uh, some bigger ears, if we so wish. You've also got control over, do you want it pixelated or do you want it to be smoothed out? And do you want a big outline, a little outline, or whatever? I'll go over the second style outline right there. I think this is the control for the outline color. Yeah, it is. Now, one suggestion I would definitely add is I would love to see uh, mouse over tooltips for what these actually control color-wise. It does get a little bit confusing. But anyways, we started our basic character right here. So you got the head shape. Next, you come in and pick a mouth for it. So we'll go with happy guy today. Uh, you position a nose then. Uh, by the way, speaking of positioning, you have the ability to move things around using this control over here. Uh, generally, you want the nose to be somewhat in the middle of the face. You pick a set of eyes to go with, a set of eyebrows to go with it. Again, all positionable. Uh, we give him a hairstyle uh, like this. We give him eyeglasses if we wish, or even 3D glasses or VR headset or so, but we'll go with none for this guy. Uh, you change up the t-shirt style like this. So again, this is just about creating a uh, profile or avatar style picks. Over here, we have different uh, facial hairs that we can go with. Give him a mustache or a soul patch, but uh, he's not Tom Selleck. I am not giving him a mustache. Uh, headbands or headgear like so. Uh, that is a little bit on the confusing. Let's see if this is actually is the control. So again, I do wish there was a mouse over to tell you which colors these actually controlled. Uh, but that is the gear side of things. We can turn that off as well. And of course, this wouldn't be the role it is without the option of cat ears. Cat ears. And that is kind of the idea. You go about, you create your character over here. Then when you're happy with it, you can go ahead and download it. And it is available as a ping file on your computer or PNG. I know some of you hate when I say ping. Uh, you can save it, basically saves it as a string. Uh, you can copy and send that string to anyone else or send it on Twitter or however you wish to share it. You can load it by entering the string back in and you will have your character there as well. On top of that, um, you can randomize it, make a number of different as your starting base. You can get an idea of the number of different uh, character avatars you could create, the variety of avatars here by playing around with the randomized number. Again, once you like any, any of these, by the way, that you change, so say we wanted a different background, uh, we could come in, we can change the background. Oops, see there, there is again why uh, the color changing interface isn't as immediately, that's the only thing I would really switch out is, is that the color changing needs to be made more clear. Otherwise it's it's just a cool tool, uh, does what it wants. Let me get away from that one because that's, that's pretty terrible. Um, so yeah, that, that is the tool, pretty straightforward what it does. If you're interested in it, the licensing, well, the key thing you got to know here, this tool can only be used to make NFTs. So non-fungible tokens, that's all that this is for. It's for creating NFTs to resell on places like Twitter or Facebook. I'm kidding. Kenny hates NFTs with a passion, and he's actually made a license to basically state you cannot use this to create any kind of an asset that involves non-fungible tokens or NFTs or blockchain related products. Otherwise use it however you wish, commercially or otherwise, just not NFTs. And I, I appreciate Kenny's crusade there. Um, by the way, if you wanna learn more, uh, he does have a website. Oh, this is, oh, oh I do have another bug. Uh, it, when it's featured, it is capturing your control tab feature. So you can't switch between sites. Uh, Kenny.nl is another place to go ahead and check things out. Kenny.nl. This is where all of his various different packs available. Uh, links to his mixers and such. Uh, interestingly enough, though, I'm a bit ahead of the curve on this one. Uh, he hasn't updated it yet. So um, the face mixer isn't here. Creature mixer is. And uh, ship mixer is. But no avatar mixer yet. By the way, do check these out as well. It's the same basic concept. This one is for making spaceships. So you can see various different hulls. You can put them together. 
Uh, otherwise, it uses pretty much the exact same process. But you see here, this one actually even has support for animated. Uh, so that here you got propellers. You can download this as an animated GIF or multiple frames or as a sprite, sh a sprite sheet with all the various different animations available. But if you want to go ahead and check out the rest of his stuff, it is available at Kenny with an E. So K-E-N-N-E-Y dot N-L. Uh, also, he's got a ton of art, art packs, uh, both free and commercial. And another one I highly recommend checking out. Uh, is Artforge. Artforge is an awesome program. I have featured it in the past as well. Uh, Shape is cool as well, but this one, this is of all the tools he's created. I think this is the coolest one personally. Uh, but now we can add the, another mixer here. We have the avatar mixer available as well. They're all up on itch.io. They're completely free. Just don't make NFTs with it and you're good to go. Let me know what you think. Comments down below. Talk to you all later and goodbye.